Now we're following developing news tonight. She was, you know, one of the most, you know, respectful, dedicated people that you want to meet. A tragic accident claims the life of a college gymnast. Melanie Coleman, a junior at Southern Connecticut State University, suffered a serious spinal injury while training on Friday. And last night, the 20-year-old from Milford died from her injuries. Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland talked with one of her longtime coaches. Matt is live now from the Southern campus with more. Matt. Well, Denise, Melanie Coleman was practicing on the uneven bars, doing something she's done thousands of times since she's been a gymnast when she just simply slipped off. And uh, for those that are close with her and her family, they say her tragic death is simply heartbreaking. I coached her for close to 10 years, three, uh, five, four to five days a week, three hours plus for each workout. So. Uh, we were very close. So for Thomas Alberti with New Air Gymnastics, Melanie Coleman's death is devastating. She loved gymnastics her entire life. It, you can't blame gymnastics or the equipment or the coaching. Coleman, a 20-year-old junior with Southern Connecticut State University's gymnastics team, was practicing on the uneven bars Friday when she slipped off, suffering a serious spinal injury. On Sunday, she passed away at Yale New Haven Hospital with family taking to Facebook saying, tonight heaven has gained a beautiful angel. Rest in peace, Melanie. We love you, are blessed, and thankful you brought in all the lives you touched. In Melanie's final act of unselfishness, she was able to provide life to others. People from all over Connecticut have been reaching out to me, and many of them knew Melanie because she was such a high-level gymnast. She was well-known uh, through the state of Connecticut. Alberti says even with her college commitment, she was still part of her old gym family, coaching younger kids as a staff member. And last year, the nursing major was named a Scholastic All-American by the Women's Collegiate Gymnastics Association. In a statement, her current college coach said, We are heartbroken and stunned by Melanie's passing. She was an incredibly hard worker and a sweet-spirited young woman. Our thoughts and prayers continue to go out to her family at this time. The SCSU gymnastics team will miss her greatly, though she will always be with us. Something Alberti says will be true at his gym as well, where Coleman's name and her lengthy accomplishments hang high up on the wall. To remember Melanie is to remember her joy and how happy that the sport uh, would make her and, and how much she loved teaching the children and giving what she had to make others better. Now, it's not just Southern that's dealing with the heavy hearts. Uh, Melanie Coleman graduated from Jonathan Law High School in Milford just a few years ago. She's a team captain, all-state gymnast there. The principal there says even though she was busy with her college commitments and her training there, she still find, found ways to give back to her high school community. We'll have that part of the story coming up tonight at 6. We're live with the Mobile Newsroom in New Haven. Matt McFarland, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.